Technology. I'm Emily Chang in San Francisco. Steve Ballmer is notorious for his enthusiastic speeches as the former CEO of Microsoft. Now he is bringing his passion for tech to the basketball court. As the owner of the LA Clippers, Ballmer is unveiling Clippers Court Vision, an augmented reality platform that puts fans in charge of their viewing experience. Court Vision, developed alongside video tech company Second Spectrum, uses a mix of machine learning, AI, and augmented reality to let viewers optimize play, predict player moves, and estimate probabilities. Fans can toggle between coach, player, and mascot modes for different diagrams and camera angles. I sat down with Balmer to discuss. Take a listen. No, you're super pumped about this. Um, you're, you're, you're pitching this as a revolutionary way to watch Clippers games and that this puts uh, the viewing experience in the hands of the viewer. How does it work? Well, what we've done essentially with our partners at Second Spectrum, a very cool technology company here in L.A., is applied artificial intelligence to watch, study the game, and then draw in real time automatically what's going on. So if you want to watch as a player would watch and see the probability that your teammates uh, will be successful for a shot, if you want to see real time diagramming of plays, we provide you that. If you want various camera angles, you can get at that. Uh, if, you, if you want live comment, commentating, you can. Uh, computer generated highlights that are available in near real time. The ability right from within either the uh, website or within the uh, applications to tweet things out. Uh, we provide all of that. That's in beta. The thing that is broadly available today, which is very exciting for people here in the Los Angeles market, is a set of augmented streams that do much of the things that I talked about, but which are available now uh, on the Fox Sports app, and uh, people can watch the game that way tonight. Well, I think what we're really trying to do is take the fans first, the fans who are already excited about the game, and give them a way to get into the game even deeper. Uh, you know, in every business, I think one of the first things you have to do is feed your, feed your enthusiasts. And particularly since NBA fans tend to skew younger, uh, we think we'll see great uptake by today's fan base. We also are building out interesting things to draw in people who know less about the game. Uh, and because this is a, essentially a software service, we'll continue to feed new, new products, new ideas into this thing with great regularity. You are collecting all of this additional data. Is this something that could also help the team win games? Yeah, this is actually built off a set of technology that came out first in an analytics product. There are six cameras in the ceiling of every NBA arena. The software that we're talking about starts by looking at the floor, seeing every player, knowing where the ball's moving, the speed. And then there's a layer of so-called machine learning software that can tell you exactly that was this kind of pick and roll. It's success rate, likelihood to lead to a shot, uh, uh, a made shot is X. It's being defended in this way. All of the core technology then feeds a set of tools that the teams do use to improve uh, the way they game plan. Uh, product named Eagle, the Clippers were one of the first users of that product, uh, again, from, uh, from this company, Second Spectrum, here in L.A. Where does the tech go from here? For example, how could legalized sports betting be integrated into this platform? Well, we have a platform in which you can show additional data real time in the game and in which you can interact. I think that makes it a great platform in which to support legalized sports betting, sports gaming when, when that comes on board. You may want to see fantasy points. You may want to see probabilities of certain things happening. There's a lot of things that might be legalized on which people can gamble. Uh, we can show those to you live on the screen and with interactivity. Uh, there's a possibility for uh, uh, online gaming partners to work with us to augment the experience in that way.